Hey everybody, it's Andy aka Max Ryder. We're back with another episode of The Hanged Man. So we got a ghost following us. And we're gonna get rid of him if we can. So we gotta hit the this floor first. Uh, let's go ahead and look at this doodle. I did not oh, he appeared next to the doodle. Okay, now we have to go up to the third floor. Into the showers there. I think this is the right one. And we gotta go look at this doodle. Cause this is the route this guy took. Yeah, we're getting it. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I mean, I think riddles are cool, but at the same time, if they're so complex that you can never, ever, ever figure them out without consulting some kind of a walkthrough, then that's not good. But this one has been pretty sweet. It's pending. Boom. Oh my god. There goes my, my flashlight's... My flashlight! Huh? Is it running out of batteries? I mean, I did just pick it up off the ground. That's not good. Is that a dog? Is somebody gonna, there? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die here. Poor little Will. What the hell? You're so scared and lost. What did I tell you? You have to believe us. Go find him quickly. Because you still can't do anything. Billy? Is it a flashback? Man, this kid is full of them. I suppose it has to do with his father's death. Well, coming to say these strange things, I mean. It was before your husband died that your son started talking about his friend, wasn't it? So I don't think there's a connection. They could simply be figments of his imagination. One of his friends is a dog. Long time no see, Will. You don't seem to be in good spirits. Or is it a billy goat? I've had enough of this hospital. They keep asking me things. It's like they're mad at me. Yes, so it seems. Even though there's nothing wrong with you. Hey, why don't you try talking to everyone, Billy? Then everyone will believe me. They'd understand that I wasn't just a weirdo talking to nothing. Well, didn't I tell you before? No one will believe in a talking dog. Here's a dog. Why don't I tell you a secret? As proof of being a good friend. I'm being mistreated by my master here. He last fed me two days ago, and the last time before that, I forget when. That's depressing. That's awful. And that's not all. The doctor here often brings a woman to the examining room. It's not his wife. There's a repulsive smell of perfume left in that room. Well, animals don't lie, unlike humans. So hmm. I want you to trust me. Try it. Go and see if what I told you is true. Will, how have you been lately? Are you still talking to those friends of yours? I'm not talking to you anymore. You're a bad man. <laughs> Why am I a bad man? Don't mistreat old Billy. What's that? Don't mistreat old Billy! Poor Billy's just a bag of bones. You're not feeding him at all! What are you talking about? Billy's my dear dog! I would never mistreat him. Granted, I haven't fed him this morning yet. Oh! Yesterday. Did I feed him? I think the day before. I've been rather... Oh, you jerk! And not just that! You're bringing a woman here! You're a liar, Doctor! A big, unfaithful coward! 
Will, calm down. You came here to talk to me, didn't you? Not fight. Don't touch me! <gasps> oh yeah, bit him! Let go! Let go, I say! <laughs> <laughs> you little demon! Horrible! Whatever, douche. Once he tells his mom that you threw him down on the floor, if she has any brains, she'll be like, screw that doctor. I told him, Billy, you're going to get fed now. You better get fed. Oh, I don't like dogs mistreated. And Believe us, Will. We don't lie. Someday one of us will appear before you. One who understands you well. Follow him. Follow him, huh? That can't have been Billy, because he... He was an old coot even way back then. There's no way he's still alive. Follow him. Was he talking about Pop? Why would he say something like that? I don't understand. I don't either. I don't either, kid. But he does have a point. I really can't do anything on my own. I'm hopeless without Pop around. Follow him, huh? I... I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do now. Now, that just leads back to the other building. Somebody's watching. Well, yeah. Oh, my God. Somebody's watching. Oh, I can open this now. Uh, that's new. Uh-oh. Push the chair, pull the chair, rotate the chair. What? Uh, hmm. Let's see if it stays the same. Okay, something about this room. Yeah, that's back to where it is. Whoops. What is going on with this thing? Wait. Pretty dirty bed. Oh, I can just do that. Okay. All right, hold on. We got to go check out that diary entry again, I guess. Um, said he, oh, I got to put it next to the bars, don't I? I got to put the chair right next to the bars. Isn't that what that guy did? He would sit next to the bar and peek out. Let's double check. I think the diary's in this room. Staff member's diary. Staff member's diary. Uh, 3408, I taped the cell. There's blinds. He sits in a chair by his bed up against the bars. All right, now we know what we must do. Got to put the chair facing the bed. Fa no, uh, next to the bed, facing the bars. Yeah, all right, all right. Maybe then I won't be scared to keep going. All right, so we got to pull the chair. Uh, let's pull it. No. Let's push it. Okay. Um, let's rotate it. Let's go ahead and pull it. And then let's push it. Damn it. Alright, well, it's still there. Sit in the chair? I have a bad feeling about that. <laughs> We're gonna save the game real quick. That is a new thing, though. We're gonna sit in the chair. Oh. Everyone, what?
Everyone is watching you. Whoa. That's creepy. Let's see if I can do anything with it. I can't. We're done. We did what we need to do. Everyone is apparently watching me. I feel like somebody's watching. Yeah, everyone. Everyone is watching, Will. Oh, that's what he could see through that. That's that's creepy. Oh, yeah. Tear it down. Stupid notice. Let's see what it looks like now. I don't think I can sit in the chair. Okay. Everyone is not watching me. Do I have the notice? No. Seems like that bad feeling went away. Hell yeah, it did. Let's see what's in this shower room. All right, where are we time-wise? Oh, we're over 10 minutes. Hey, this is a good place to stop. Um, so we know where we're going next. We're going out the end of this hallway. Ugh. All right. Damn it. <laughs> I do not want to do that. So thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to you all next time.